Next week, Allegheny County Democrats will vote to nominate one of six candidates running for county executive. The winner will face the only Republican running, Joe Rocky, in the fall. In the second part of a four-part series, KDK political editor John Delano asks each of the candidates what experience they have to run a multi-billion dollar county government. Six Democrats say they have the qualifications to run the state's second largest county, including former Pittsburgh School Board President Teresa Shuley Kalazi, former County Councilman Dave Fawcett, State Representative Sarah Inamorato, Pittsburgh City Controller Michael Lamb, mobile app developer Will Parker, and County Treasurer John Weinstein. I asked each why they are qualified to oversee a $3 billion county budget. No one has the unparalleled experience that I have in operating the day-to-day -day operation of Allegheny County. I understand the $3 billion budget. I understand all of our departments, all of the responsibilities that we have, because I've been working with it for 25 years. I don't need to be trained for this job. While Weinstein stresses his day-to-day -day knowledge of county government as treasurer, Lamb says he has both county experience and the ability to appoint the best people. Having the experience of, of administering an office uh, is, is key to, to this job. For the last 15 years as city controller, um, you know, we have put a, a premium on bringing in best talent, uh, you know, merit hiring, um, but also uh, hiring for diversity. Um, as you know, uh, my, my first deputy, uh, Doug Anderson, an African-American, that was done by design. In Amarado cites her own business degree from Pitt and work as a nonprofit social services consultant in the community, while Fawcett points to his role as a business attorney, not a politician. As a state representative, I, I manage an office. Uh, I also serve on the boards from the Urban Redevelopment Authority and the Allegheny County Housing Authority, which is responsible for you know, hundreds of millions of dollars um, in development and dollars that are extremely consequential to the future of this region. I'm not a career politician. I was on the county council for a couple terms. I know all about county government, but I'm also a lawyer, a business lawyer, and a, and a business litigator. So I've tried cases around the country, and they're big cases, and they involve managing one, uh, helping to manage the firm, and in addition, managing many people on big tasks. It's something I've done all my career. Parker, a mobile app developer, cites his own business experience, while Kalazi cites her school board leadership and small business ownership. I have a, uh, over a decade of experience in the delivery uh, industry. Uh, I've ran a business, I've hired people. Uh, at times when, it was, uh, when I had to, I had to fire people. In the 12 years I've served, 11 of them never raised taxes, yet we gave preschool. We continued to fund everything we needed. I settled 19 union contracts during that, 19 union contracts in my 12 years of unpaid elected position. I ran my own business for 30 years. Allegheny County Democrats have just a short time to decide which of these six nominees they want to be their next county executive. The primary is May 16th. In downtown Pittsburgh, I'm John Delano, KDKA TV News.